Good afternoon, everybody. Hope you've been enjoying this broadcast. Next, I've got a surprise in mind, so sit back and relax. I'm ready for my save. I'd say that's about four days of beard. The four days taken up by our latest expedition in search of our troops. The other boys on the group, they should have this much beard too. We did it right, you know. We got the main ones, we brought back some dead. Some still alive. Pretty soon, they'll all be dead. How many did you catch? Fourteen. We had to go pretty deep into the woods to get them. But we'll get even. We'll get every last one. Not one of them comes out of this alive. Not one. The town must have learned a lesson from what he did the other day. Yes. That was a fine show, eh? Very good. I could easily go to sleep right now. There's plenty of work to do this afternoon. Firing squad. Something like that. But only a little bit slower. Come to the school at 6 o'clock. Same thing as the other day? It could be a little better. What do you plan to do? I'm not sure yet. But we'll amuse ourselves. Do you plan to punish them all? All. I've never had him so close to me. His name was Captain Torres. I came face to face with him one day when he ordered the whole town to file into the patio of the school. But the sight of the mutilated bodies kept me from noticing the face of the man who directed it all. The face I was now about to take into my hands. How many of us had he ordered shot? How many of us had he ordered mutilated? It was better not to think about it. Torres didn't know that I was his enemy. Damn him for coming, because I'm a revolutionary, not a murderer. How easy would it be to kill him, though no one deserves to have someone else make the sacrifice of becoming a murderer. I wouldn't give him time to complain. He wouldn't see the glistening knife blade or my glistening eyes, but I'm trembling like a real murderer. I would have to close the door and the blood would keep inching along the floor warm, uncontainable until it reached the street, like a little scarlet stream. But what would I do with the body? I would have to flee, leaving all I have behind and take refuge far away. Captain Torres was found murdered today. The culprit, a local barber, slit his throat while shaving him. Murderer or hero, my destiny depends on the edge of this blade. But I don't want to be a murderer. He came to me for a shave and I performed my work honorably. I don't want blood on my hands, just lather, that's all. You're the executioner and I'm a barber. Each person has his own place in the scheme of things. They told me you've killed me. I came to find out. But killing isn't easy. You can take my word. 